How's everybody out there in YouTube land today? I hope this finds you well. We got another exciting episode of Heifer Haven's Free Advice. And we got our heifer here at the ready. Look at her, her eyeballs all polished up and her, her nostrils flared. She's like, what are we going to talk about today, Brendan G? What are we going to talk about today? Well, I'm about to tell you. Before I do, though, there's one thing we've always got to do, and that's <laughs> more cowbell. <laughs> now that we got your attention, let's see what our letter has to say today. Dear Heifer Haven, Easter is the us. I have little children. They're asking me now if there really is an Easter bunny. It's only a matter of time before we have to discuss the Santa Claus and Tooth Fairy and all that other stuff, too. I don't like lying to my children, but I want them to believe in the magic. What advice do you have for me? Well, my advice to you is don't lie to the children. Just go out, get you a rabbit, stick some eggs underneath that rabbit, and then take the kids out and say, look, this is the Easter Bunny. These are the eggs that the Easter Bunny has laid. I can't be any more truthful with you than this. Here it is. Or you could just be truthful with them and say, listen, everything that you experience in life is going to be a great big lie. And so is the Easter Bunny and the Tooth Fairy and, <laughs> and Santa Claus and all of it. So, you know, there you go, and you can shatter their little dreams and, and go on. They're going to learn about it in school anyway, because the other kids that already know are going to tell them, that they, look, there ain't no Easter, but that's probably where they've heard it anyhow. So, you know, it's up to you. But I kind of like the idea of getting a rabbit and sticking some eggs underneath it and telling them that's what happened. I, I used to tell little kids to come to my house when I had rabbits, they'd be looking underneath the cages and see. <laughs> see what the rabbits had left behind underneath the cages, you know, they'd say, oh, hey, what's that? And I'd say, them's called bunny berries. That's what you put on your breakfast cereal of the morning to make your breakfast taste good. You'll need a bag of them before you leave here today. You used to drive the parents nuts, but I thought it was the funniest thing ever. Hey, I said this was free advice. I never said be good.